when an actor that really understands his character applies movement, aggression, and emotion behind the movement, um, it just feels better. It feels different. It feels there's so much more. It's it's so much more uh, richness to it, and um, it could be a haymaker. But the way Tom Cruise or Henry Cavill throws the haymaker makes a big difference to me, and I can feel that emotion. I can feel the intention a little bit more, and that is what I look for. Even if it's a training segment, like something in Dune, you know, there's a, that 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 training segment with um, what's his name, Berlin and um, Timothy Chalamet. The rhythm and the lesson that his instructor is teaching him, there's so much more applied to it than just some Kali movements. There's the way that they're applying the movements, the the rhythm, the conversation that they're having. When it's done in that way, um, I'm just taken aback and I'm inspired all over again. I'm inspired all over again. And the thing I've done is I've actually taken that mentality and I've gone back to like 1985 or 1983 and watched Wheels on Mills and I watched Benny and Jackie go at it. And I'm like, they were doing it. They were doing it. And that's what I, that's what moved me back then. I may not have known it. I may have thought it was that rolling kip up and then knocking, you know, blowing the candles out with a kick, all those spectacle things. It's not, it wasn't, I don't think it was. I think it was the way that they performed. The energy that they poured, that they put, the emotion they put, Bruce, he's got charisma in everything he does. So it really comes back to telling the story. It really comes back to understanding the character's motivations. And I know that sounds like actor studio type stuff, but man, it really is effective for me as a viewing, as a viewer. Um, and that's kind of my, that's my number one thing when I watch 